Hello and welcome to newsclick.in. This is 420 grams, the most power-packed football panel ever assembled in the history of Indian football. Do you guys agree? Agree. <laughs> <laughs> Just a quick introduction. I'm Siddhant Ani. On my right is Arjun Pandit, Ishfaq Ahmed. And joining us from Imphal uh, is the beautiful Mr. Renidi Singh, <laughs> who is studying to become Michelle Obama these days. Thanks for, thanks for taking the time, guys. Uh, to set the agenda for today's conversation, we're talking about the potential next coach of the senior men's uh, football team for India. Of course, since Stephen Constantine resigned after the Asian Cup, this is a conversation that has started up and we're looking ahead to build uh, the future of Indian football and it's a critical element who becomes the coach of yeah. the senior men's national team. So, uh, setting for us the tone of this conversation is Abhishek Yadav, a former striker, former teammate of you guys. Um, he is now the head of uh, national teams, looking after the administration of, of the national teams. Uh, we spoke to him about, uh, firstly, the process of identifying the national coach, how it works. So this is what Abhishek had to say on the process part. The process uh, to appoint the new head coach will begin soon. Uh, we'll be uh, releasing an advertisement uh, and then uh, on the basis of the uh, CVs that we receive, uh, whichever uh, coach is best suited for the national team, uh, the decision will be taken by the technical committee. Abhishek, also, if you can just point out a couple of things. One, uh, is the All India Football Federation looking at bringing in someone who is already in the Indian football environment? For example, uh, someone who is a, maybe a head coach with an ISL team who's already got some experience of operating in India and knows the players and the system. And secondly, is there a sort of concerted effort now to develop an Indian style of play, a way in which our national teams from junior to senior level will be looking to approach the game? Sure, there are some really uh, good uh, coaches uh, you know, in ISL and uh, we are pretty open. As I said, uh, the coach best suited for the job uh, will be considered and uh, the technical committee will take the call. I think the style of play, uh, again, you know, we need to discuss uh, this in detail with the new uh, head coach. And uh, of course, also with the players. And based on everyone's opinion, uh, you know, definitely we'll uh, try and work out something on that. So, uh, question one: the way what Abhishek said, basically the ad will go out sometime soon. Hmm. But we already have some names that have come into the conversation. The most recent and high-profile being Sven Joran Eriksson, hmm. the former uh, England coach, England manager. Who is currently who was at the Asian Cup with the Philippines, right? So apparently, the reports are that his uh, agent has said that he is perhaps willing to consider this role. So my question to you guys, all three of you, uh, is: What would your approach be if you were in a position to have an influence on this decision? Would you look at an Indian coach, a foreign coach, someone who knows the Indian scenario? How how would you like to operate? Well, uh, for me, I think the first thing, the positive thing, is coach like Ericsson is willing to come, which is which is like a good message. You know, like top coaches are, you know, like they are looking uh, for Indian job, which is a fantastic news, uh, especially after this year. But um, I personally feel we should have someone who who has a little bit knowledge of Indian football, and uh, maybe no players, some of the players and uh, have the experience of because you know like whenever i have i have played uh, under some coaches foreign coaches and worked with some coaches they always say that when they come over here india what they have heard is something different what they have seen here so i feel like somebody who has that experience in in his hand like been here can be a, a really good option secondly I think we should be prepared for how long and uh, how long we want and what plans we have. Because you are playing the next Asian Cup in all likelihood. So cycle should be Asian Cup to Asian Cup. Kind of. I totally agree. It should be like, it should not be a short term. I think uh, it has to be a well thought out process how to get a, what kind of coach we want. And ideally, if, if you ask me, 
uh, we should prefer some of the coaches past who have been here with the ISL, some of the top coaches or some, some of them are still here. Uh, regardless their profile, maybe we should look at their results, what they have done with some of the Indian young players, how they have performed in the club level. So we should definitely have one eye there as well. Uh, Renity, coming to you, uh, uh, putting yourself in the AIFF shoes and considering the difference between club football and national team football, how the differences from a coach's perspective in managing a national team versus a club team, what would be your perspective? How would you be looking at it? It's very difficult, whatever we may say, to be a national team coach. First of all, we hardly play any matches. So to organize, I think it, it's a difficult one. So for that, we need someone who understands. We, we can go for a big name, but then it will take time, first of all, to understand one or two years. And then our, our, our fans also, they would want, now as we have won against Thailand 4-1, our expectation has gone high. So we need someone who understand Indian football. So say suppose ISL, there are one or two or three coaches who are doing really well. If you see, if you see the game, so I think there will be, they should have a good chance to be an Indian coach. Yes, I, I want to have our national Indian coaches. So I, Direk is going going to have it. I think I'm very happy to to see Direk has become under 23. <coughs> we are not doing well in under 16. Pinto and Mahesh doing well for Indian arrows. So Indian young coaches in India they are doing well. But to, for the national team coach, I think, you know, if we look at ISL, there are one or two or three coaches who are doing well. And if can they become, it will be more easier for the players and for the coach also. You know, I kind of agree with both Ishwak and Randy Bhai. Now, the thing is, if you get a new coach and you get a new coach, generally, you get a new coach, you get a big name, when you come and get your own ethos, you get to change, you get to see the players. उस टाइम पे हमारी टीम उस लेवल पे है नहीं हमारी टीम उसके आगे बढ़ गई है एवरीवन ऑल एग्री कि एशियन कप पे वी हैड अ वेरी गुड एशियन कप इन रिस्पेक्ट ऑफ द रिजल्ट्स नाउ व्हाट दिस टीम नीड्स इज नॉट मेजर चेंजेस बट माइनर ट्वीक्स टू टेक इट टू अनदर लेवल एंड अनदर लेवल मींस क्वालिफाइंग फॉर द नेक्स्ट एशियन कप एंड डूइंग अ लिटिल बेटर देन व्हाट दे हैव बीन डूइंग इन द पास्ट या आई टोटली एग्री विद पंडित यू नो व्हाई बिकॉज़ वी नीड समवन फर्स्ट वी हैव सीन दैट फर्स्ट मैच वी प्लेड रियली वेल but I think sec second and third match, we were not tactical enough. So, I think we were a little too defensive. So we Believe me, we don't have to, yeah, yeah, we don't have to change that much. But we need someone who is a little more tactical. Oh, sorry. We, we, we need someone who is a little more tactical than the last one and who understands Indian football. So, uh, our coaches from ISL, we, because they have been saying, we don't have time. You know, It will take one year to understand. When Bob Outen was there, of course, we have best five years. But then two years to believe, to get into that system. Mm. So, do we have two years now? No. So, I want to add very uh, one valid point, which is, I think, uh, which Rene Dibai has mentioned, is the experience, uh, having a national team experience. And um, e even if we are picking somebody from the uh, ISL also, mm. you know, like, there is one factor which we should have. They are playing with the five foreigners. Five, yeah, yeah. You have to, you have to play, you have to believe, uh, put all trust on the 11 Indian players and get them best out of them. So, to some extent, yes, we need somebody who knows already Indian football and maybe we also know, all the players know what kind of coach he is and what style he is playing. But then, uh, the, 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 Na uh, national team experience is something where Rene Dibai have mentioned we don't play many matches. You have to wait for that uh, uh, FIFA window and then play matches. I think that might be one thing to look into also as a very important part. Yeah, because now we know that like this whole system that was in place in India, which was before, that if you are playing a match today, then one month before you will have a camp. कैंप में 35 प्रोबेबल जाएंगे उसके बाद उससे फाइनल स्क्वाड बनेगा अब वो नहीं होने वाला है बिकॉज़ आपका सीजन लंबा चलेगा क्लब्स रिलीज नहीं करेंगे प्लेयर्स तो मैक्सिमम आपको चार या पांच दिन मिलेंगे और उसके बाद द प्रेशर इज देयर टू गेट रिजल्ट्स राइट सो द प्रेशर ऑन द नेशनल टीम कोच इवन दो यू आर प्लेइंग लेट्स से 10 12 मैचेस इन द होल ईयर कैलेंडर ईयर नॉट द सीजन बट येट द प्रेशर इज देयर टू गेट रिजल्ट आफ्टर रिजल्ट आफ्टर रिजल्ट दिस presents a different, very different set of challenges hmm. for the national team. And also he doesn't get to basically work 
with the players on a day in day out basis but uh, honestly which national team coach does get to work with them on a day in day out basis aise hi to hota hai international football mein hmm. ki teen char din pehle aap milte ho aur uske baad the coach assesses you and chooses you aapko lagta hai ki is it a good idea to have ek acha manager top manager and somebody from the isl to assist him or something like that yeah it's not a bad idea actually shwa randy bhai what do you make of it but i don't know if a, a, a isl manager will be happy doing an assisting role that's my only thing but maybe some someone from isl who have worked with some top manager see I, I, like very quickly my point of view on this is just that having a big name manager on top has only one real benefit that over the course of his career that person unhone apne contacts apna network banaya hoga ki agar aaj china ka head coach koi hai to main usko personal basis pe janta hu main usko phone karke i can set up ki yaar 6 mahine baad friendly khelte hain Which maybe maybe Ishfaq Ahmed or Randy Singh cannot just call uh, Zakaroni or someone like that or, and say ki bhai what's happening let's play a game right but in terms of what that person brings to the this development process of the national team I'm I would say that like I'm on his team here where I would definitely say if we're putting faith in the indian players and the indian system the system that we are trying to create then i really think that we should because we have so little to lose we should also put the faith in an indian coach to lead nahin, the team nahin, main main nahi manta ye you don't have so little to lose yaar ab aapne finally momentum pakda hai agar aap 4 saal baad asian cup pe nahi pahunche that will be a mass, massive massive setback yaar main you matlab to carry it on now the momentum yaar piche nahi hat sakte ab अब फाइनली गाड़ी पटरी पे आई है तो आप ये कह रहे हैं कि ये जितने सारे लोग हैं जो अपने कोर्सेज वोर्सेज कर रहे हैं जो असिस्ट कर रहे हैं काफ़ी जगह एक्सपीरियंस ले रहे हैं जो खुद प्रोफेशनल प्लेयर्स रह चुके हैं इंटरनेशनल फुटबॉल खेल चुके हैं यू थिंक यू आर सेइंग दैट दे वुड नॉट बी इन अ पोजिशन टू इम्प्रूव आर परफॉर्मेंस ओवर कोर्स ऑफ फोर ईयर्स आई आई नॉट राइट नाउ तो मैं मैं मेरा मेरा मानना ये हाँ रेडी भाई यूट मेक अ पॉइंट आई कम आफ्टर यू सी नाउ ऑफ कोर्स येस इंडियन कोचेस यंग कोचेस आर डूइंग वेल बट टू गेट द हेड कोच फॉर फॉर द सीनियर टीम आई थिंक वी स्टिल थ्री फोर ईयर्स आई रेस्पेक्ट हिम आई रेस्पेक्ट सैव दे हैव डन वेल बट डिरेक्ट अंडर ट्वेंटी थ्री इज अ गुड चांस फॉर हिम टू शो दैट हाउ गुड ही इज Yeah, and then for other young players like say Pinto, Mahesh, uh, Viviano, we still take three, four years. No, so, but, but young, what do you guys? What do you guys so make of this approach? Say, like, what do you <coughs> hope that Indian coaches will be able to learn in the next three, four years, which will put them in that position? Experience, simple. I think for me, Jose, he is saying that after three, four years, like we may think on them, like experience. जो national team का football होता है, I think it is all about experience. They are getting experience. The club football and the national team uh, uh, is, uh, is there is a huge gap. I, See, I totally now, now believe with, that. From under twenty three, Direk will learn so much. That will that's the best chance and best platform for him, and he will learn a lot. And if he does well. then why not in in some days maybe two or three years why not direct should become a coach you you see you see in japan or in korea everyone it's it's all their national uh, ex national players so it will be a good in one or two years that's the thing what, what i feel but then now we, the expectations are too high sidan the 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 expectation from the fans after winning i'm i'm telling you they are not going to you know be happy with a draw or so No, but so now we, we but that is good by because that those expectation came when we performed like yeah, guys yeah. did very well which is which is in a way good we should not i totally agree mai bhai ke sath arjun ke sath completely agree karta hu bhai humne acha khela agar hum log kuch aisa decision lenge wo char kadam piche le jayenge hum no no i i i agree as well so when the expectation are high boss you have to perform every single match and for that We 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 don't have time to lose. So if we get someone high profile with all the big names, we we may not get. You know. As so why don't as, we go for someone? The, mm. Randy, why? As far as the Indian coach is concerned, मेरा ये मानना है. I'm not. I have nothing mm. against uh, Derek. Mm. And I honestly feel being in charge of a under 23 championship two months before that championship. अभी I think camp लगा है Goa में. उससे ज़्यादा आपको इतना experience नहीं मिलेगा. मेरा मानना ये है कि जो Floyd Pinto and your Bibiano Fernandez who are doing really well with the under 16 teams. let them form a core five six players and the coach takes that core into the senior team like felix sanchez did with qatar 
he had a core of young boys five six boys and he took them there lekin yahan pe arjun kya hota hai ki qatar the league structure is different wahan log wo 6 mahine apne national team ke sath rehte hain baad mein बिकॉज लीग इज सो स्मॉल तीन महीने के बाद खत्म होता है फिर नेशनल टीम के साथ यहाँ पे वंस एज एनी सेट लाइक वंस द सीजन बिकम्स बिग इट्स अ ह्यूज प्रॉब्लम लाइक नाउ यू सी अंडर डेरिक आई फील रियली बै अनफॉर्चुनेटली ही हैज उसके पास उतना टाइम ही नहीं है कि ज़्यादा टाइम है ही नहीं कि वो ही इज ही इज रिलाइंग ऑन वेंकटेश जो भी उनका फीडबैक है क्योंकि एटलीस्ट he 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 has venki bhai there to tell him like kon kon player hai kyunki derek sir zyada goa fc ke sath the but as renedi bhai said now he has still opportunity imagine he doing good and why not after a couple of years to consider him only for the job no, but my point is sorry sorry renedi bhai yeah 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 you go on, go, on, go on. my point is i don't think you can judge derek sir on this one tournament it would be harsh because we are thinking they're doing very well what if it doesn't turn out and then you say no no derek perera can't no, no. Do senior team no no we, we know derek has done well in the i league right derek is a good coach everyone knows that so now he has got very limited time it, it, it's a bad part but then again we, this shouldn't be the last for under 23 we have to create a platform to play more matches and and, and then we can judge after that not on this derek is a derek should be derek should carry on for another one year or two and and after with those experienced under 23 there are many under 23 is like many when you are 19 you can play senior so from that on i think direct can take over in one or two years after that if he does well bhai so so, why not? so indirectly mm-hmm. are you uh, are you saying that ke hum log ko under 23 ke liye indian coach chahiye aur senior ke liye kyunki last I, match I like mein that, I like that idea, La, last match last last side last time pe ek hi coach dono team chala raha tha So, do uh, we... I I I don't want I don't want the the head coach the senior head coach to run the under 23. Let under 23 be with Derek. This shouldn't be the last tournament, and he should carry on for many more tournaments. And then let's see how he proves. No, and we have to give him a chance. Not only this tournament, like Pandit said. You know, if he doesn't do well, we we can't judge Derek. But uh, but as far as I know, I think it is uh, Derek sir's also choice whether he wants to be late continue with the under 23. Now because he has already a. Yeah. Tough choice actually. Uh, uh, he is already the uh, uh, youth development head of uh, Goa FC, and uh, either we should allow I, either we should allow him to do the both the jobs, and then I, it's fair I, for him. I think Derek would want to see uh, how many matches under 23 is going to play first, and, and how much money he will be getting. So he he has a life to live. So we have to see that, and from that point of view, if he is happy on that, you know. I was saying that just, why not? गिव हिम लॉन्ग टर्म दोनों जॉब दे दो उसको अगर अगर गोवा भी गोवा को भी कोई प्रॉब्लम नहीं है राइट नाउ इट इज दैट लेकिन अभी तो कंसिडर लेकिन फिर चला रहे हैं तो हम लोग उनको कब तक रहेंगे और बिलीव इज देर अंडसम सैलरी फॉर हिम ही फैमिली वी हैव टू सी दैट ऑल्सो एंड ही इज नॉट अ a uh, small coach kafi no, no, senior coach he has but the, like this this two jobs thing I, i also have to agree that like because as it is like top level jobs for indian coaches in the sport are very limited there are 10 15 jobs at the most right to agar aap ek aadmi ko do jobs de rahe hain to you also taking away the opportunity for one more person to get that exposure and learn mm-hmm. and and also grow valid. as a coach themselves so valid point no but but what what i want to say here do not just get indian coach just because you think that you are going to pay less and be a coach get a indian coach on his abilities and pay like you were paying the our, our coaches ahead our but that is the co- that is the question a big question unfortunately it happens in the leagues also i league also it has been happening isl also when you take the aap indian coach le rahe ho bhai chalo koi baat nahi usko kam mein nip kitna kitna aap log aap log khele hue ho highest level pe kitna difference hota hai and i'm not asking you to give me exact salaries but In two times, five times, six times, how much difference is in coaches? If you look at the package, see, see, IS, ISL coaches they are quite, they are getting quite a lot, right? But 
but Indian coaches, I feel there is a gap. I don't know exactly, but there is for sure, say, uh, the World Cup coach, coaches were there, the German coach and the Portuguese coach. And, the, and, and Derek, exactly, I don't know how much he's getting, but then I feel there is a gap. But then times are changing. Football is getting better. And if you want to see Indian football better, we have to change this mentality. I also feel like at some level, this might become a top-down kind of an issue because a lot of money for that goes towards the salary of the national team head, head coach comes from FIFA money. Uh, the F uh, FIFA goal fund, FIFA development funds, which is like a fixed chunk of money specifically for the purpose of the coach. Mm. So, I think those guys ask or stipulate that a foreign coach comes in simply because they want more experienced people who can develop the system better. No, no, but if you are taking their money at the end of the day, to, then you have to listen to what they are saying also. Na? Yeah, agreed. That also becomes a factor. Like something like a Rob Barn, what he was doing, then I can understand. But Rob Barn can't be your national team coach. Because then you are sort of breaking up his responsibilities. The national team coach is just focused on this, these are my players. And I think after the Asian Cup and currently where the Indian team stands, I think your group 30 ka set is now. For the next three years also. I think we are missing one, one thing over technical director which yeah. will be a huge saying when we take a coach. Leke I think I am in technical committee. I think he, he might, we might have a technical director sitting next to us also. That. And then the technical director takes into account who you are going to play, makes your schedule. I, I think that's why otherwise you technical director. Kis liye leke aate ho? Hmm. I think if Reni D. Bai is a technical director and I am... He, if I am not on the same lines with him, I can't, can't function. Him. That's so, okay. Yeah, I, I think that, that's a good, that's a good point. So when you appoint a technical director and technical director duty, say suppose if we have direct for under 23 coach and if we have a foreign coach for senior team, then like we said, from under 23 to senior, we need to have a good understanding. So to get a good team, I think the senior coach and under direct has to have a good under that understanding. This the middleman should be uh, by the uh, technical director. Yeah, so he has he plays an important role in there. Since we're talking about technical committee, Ishwak, uh, like Abhishek told Siddhant at the beginning of the show, ki jo ad aega, then we will see the best possible candidate send it to the technical committee. What exactly do you guys look for? Is it a presentation? Is it the map ahead? See, whenever there is a decision to make for technical committee, there will be for new, now new profiles will come. So there will be selected coaches, they, are, they might filter the coaches by humne itne select kiye, ye suits ho rahe, mm -hmm. ye char hai. Now let's take this is like then, everybody will be there. There is a Sham Thapas who is the chairman and Henry who is the vice chairman and a couple of us are there. Then that is where when you have already figured out like ki ye char hai. So from there, hamara job hai ki uh, in mein se char mein se kon achha hai, who will, we, you know, like everybody will have a say on that ki which, whichever one we want to feel or uh, ki ye hamare future ke liye best hai, Indian he, uh, he can bring. Aap kya dekh rahe ho toh exactly? Because presentation hoti, sab to bet ke apna wapa interview dete To be honest, I personally feel like unka khud ka record kaisa hai? Uh, as a managerial record kaisa hai? For me, having a knowledge of Indian football is compulsory. I have worked with some of the top managers uh, in ISL. Mm. I think uh, if you, you know the knowledge, for example, traveling one state to other state in India is a big huge thing for them. Yeah. If Indian, you, uh, Indian standard time. Exactly. <laughs> uh, matlab, all those things he has to you know be prepared for that and uh, I think there will be the interviews also then later on who knows who is aware of Indian football also. Mm. I think ultimately agar char, char achhe profiles select kiye hai, for me it should be ke un mein se sabse achhi knowledge Indian football ke liye, uh, ke, that's hai? the critical point. I, for me, that, for that's me. the critical point. And because if someone has played in Asia, mein bhi khela hai, so, somewhere has, has a, a huge knowledge. And if somebody is coming directly from that Europe, top uh, oh, mentality, yeah. to, it may be first very difficult. Very difficult for so, Reni D. Bino, he, he gave the example of Bob. It took them two years to uh, understand understand the things how he wants to. So, Reni D. Bino, Sven, Joran Eriksson, ka patta. 
<laughs> no, I mean, Sven Goran Eriksson have done well with England, have done well with Lazio, you know, he's and he's very close to, you know, uh, Bob. And he's very close to the Crystal Palace coach, Roy Hawkson. So he's not a bad coach, you know, but he have, he have been there, done that, you know. But then for him to come and understand, I don't know how it will, will, will take a long time. I guess we should also coach. be realistic and not like sort of these multi-million dollar salaries that he's used to. Those are not the kind of salaries that Indian yeah. football can afford. I mean, so we shouldn't even, we shouldn't even, no, I guess. We, we, yeah, we have to see how much money do we have. No, and AFF also they have at the end, the end, end if we want them, then the thing will come back to that point. Why? If they have the idea of this salary, they have the idea that we have so much money and so much salary. Mein aana so I think that may be, as uh, Arjun, you were telling, that might be a critical point later on. Money, the world is attacking the world. This is a great story. But my point is, we should get a coach who has a point to prove. He should have a point to prove. And, 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 and the coach who understand, one, one, one. and the coach who understand, and who can work with with Derek also, you know, under 23 is very close to the senior, so we have a good understanding. You know, when a big high profile come, they, in the meantime they know who is the best co best coach. Uh, then the six seven months is already over, and then if you can't perform, and the next month you are out. Renny, so I, I have one question to everyone. Ren, before Asia Cup, do you guys knew who is the coach of Qatar? No. No idea. You had any idea who is the coach of Qatar before Asia Cup? मतलब Asia Cup से पहले आपको पता था Qatar का coach कौन है? No, no idea. So I think that's my one of my answer to yeah. your thing. Should I have point to prove basically? Should have the want to do something at the international level to do something that's not been done before? If you if you read his uh, interviews and more about him, what he have done for the Qatari national team is remarkable. Like yeah, uh, but he can only do when when you know someone when you uh, Indian football really well. We need person. He can only click a, a, a person whoever is coming can only click quickly. If he is already, from, from, yeah. yeah, like yeah, that already, guy, yeah. that guy had been after he left. Those are six से वो कतर में है यार. वही बोल रहा हूँ ना. तो वो academy level पे काम कर रहा है. It can be somebody who has like point to prove, which yeah. is again a question somebody from already who has worked, who is worked, in the system, here, yeah. right? So this is what I'm. This is what essentially I was asking. कि अगर हम if that Qatari guy can be made the national coach after. In 2017, after being in the system for 11 years, then there are so many of you guys who are now licensed coaches and have been in the system for 10 years, 15 years, 20 years. Why can you not? Why do you not have the same hunger or the same ability to prove yeah, a point? Definitely, have. As Renidi Bai said, like in future there is one new generation of coaches coming. I think we have a really good future in coaching department. Also. We we need to have experience now, uh, Sidan. We we really need to have experience. You know, of course, being an assistant, uh, we get to learn a lot. But the, I was talking to uh, Isfak uh, two days back. You know, we need to be our own boss. We need to make mistakes Absolutely. and we learn from there. We we go down. We don't have to stay in ISL forever. You know, be there, learn from the best coaches one or two years, and go down and and be your own boss. And then make your own mistake, and from that mistake you will learn, and that will take another two or three years. And in three years you will be able to see, like I said, you know, whatever we have learned, we will make mistakes, and we will be able to see a good coaches coming up. But for senior coaches right now, I feel we we still have have a few years time. So but where the next cycle? Where will uh, the next Asian Cup? Where we'll have an where game. will that experience come from? Yeah. Yeah. Unless, say for a uh, national league, say for uh, I league, I league we have our Indian coaches, right? And this is a good experience for young, say for Isfak, if he comes down to I League and if you get one, if you get hold of one team, every single day you're going to learn. So so we are we have good coaches, right? We have young coaches coming in in I League also. We, I'm not going for ISL top coaches. No, no, no. I'm going for I League and get that learning lesson from I League and from there you will be you will be way more confident. So that, that's a good mujhe, step. Mujhe lagta what Renny Dibai is saying, absolutely. At least I I will guarantee you, jo abhi younger generation, former footballers, top footballers who have played 15, 20 years, are well knowledgeable, really into coaching, and have been doing really good in the badges like they have been doing. 
and that that i will guarantee you so we have a good future in coaching department also and one good coach means we will definitely produce good players mm. bad coach means we might spoil <laughs> a good do, player <laughs> good, yes. good player so yeah. so that's a good thing to have like knowledgeable coach is coming like renidi bhai uh, clifford miranda who has done now pro uh, who is doing the pro as well uh, samir nayak who is the head coach of the dempo Uh, Mehraj is the under 18 uh, uh, coach of the Pune City. Uh, I have completed myself. Uh, there are couple of Noel Wilson have come uh, just passed also. So there is a bunch of coaches who are coming. You know, like uh, have been doing. Uh, actually, uh, will definitely help Indian football. All right. So thanks very much, guys, for all of those points of view. I think that pretty much summarizes the search or how the search for a national team should uh, proceed. Uh, I'm hoping that we will catch these two young coaches <laughs> in a in in about a, a month's time, maybe even playing or putting teams up that will face each other in the Super Cup. क्या बात है ये क्या हो रहा है ये कुछ कुछ आ रही है बात धीरे-धीरे. But भुवनेश्वर पहुंचे से पहले हम I League की बात करेंगे because एक बड़ा deadly season खत्म हुआ है I League का. So we'll be coming to you reviewing that whole season, doing a roundup of that whole season where there's been a lot of drama. and some decent football as well so stay tuned for that and until then thanks for watching and thanks for joining in guys we'll see you again soon